Meet Nolly, Maui, Elvis, and Penny. This quartet of rescue dogs from Oahu and right here from home are part of the Invasive Species Detector Dog Team. It's a pilot project with the Guam Department of Agriculture, Biosecurity Division, and the University of Guam Research Corporation. Garrett Certeza is a project leader. We have a three-year grant from the Department of Interior and Insular Affairs, and they gave us a grant to start a detector dog team specifically to look for invasive species. Invasive species like the coconut rhinoceros beetle that's been wrecking havoc not just at home, but across the Pacific. Unfortunately, it's even moved from, Hawaii, uh, from Guam to Hawaii and from, from Guam to, to Rota. So we hope to prevent the rhino beetle from moving to other islands. These working dogs can sniff out rhino beetles hiding in the cargo, making sure the invasive species don't reach our neighboring islands. Local boonie Nai already raring to go. Whether it's six beetles, four, or just one, she's trained to sit once she catches a whiff of any of these hitchhikers. <laughs> Besides the detector dog team, program coordinator Andrea Bloss adding there's more the team is doing to prevent these destructive beetles from spreading. This is spores of the biocontrol fungus suspended in water and we'll take this and treat the artificial breeding sites or breeding sites of the rhino beetle. From spraying biocontrol fungus to target larvae and eggs, injecting pesticide into coconut trees to target adult rhino beetles, to hanging pheromone lure panels around our ports of entry. It's all in an effort to save the tree of life, not just at home, but throughout the Pacific. Matsuki Hariyama, KUAM News.